Hey everyone, Tom with TK Designs here. As you may know, I retired from the United States Navy in 2010. This is promotion month for the ranks of the E-7 in the Navy and also the Army and Marine Corps. This is the first part of a three-part series of plaques I made to commemorate the promotion of the Navy Chief Petty Officers, a Gunnery Sergeant, and a Sergeant First Class. Let's kick this off after the break. <laughs> Okay, so for this project, uh, this is going to be a plaque that's 20 inches by 14 inches and will contain the rank insignia here in this section. And over in this section, we're going to laser engrave the inscription, which is actually about 10 paragraphs long, followed by a name and a date of presentation. Uh, for this project, this is, again, one of three, and we'll be putting my new uh, X-Tool uh, S1 laser to work on the project. So we're gonna V-carve this, and so in order to do that, we're gonna, we're gonna make this rank insignia stand about 10 millimeters proud. So we are going to cut 10 millimeters down and remove all of this material around the outside of the rank insignia. So I drew a little box that surrounds the outside and will clear the uh, workpiece on all sides, giving us a nice clean plaque which we can engrave on. So with our tool paths, I'm going to highlight all the tool paths and we're going to do a V-carve tool path. In this, we're starting at a start depth of zero and going at depth of 10 millimeters, so a little more than, or a little less than a half inch. Uh, we're going to use our 10.5 degree V-bit, and this time we're going to use two clearance tools. We're going to use our, our hog from IDC, it's a one quarter inch upcut bit, and a one eighth inch end mill to clean things up. And we'll call this SFC. For Sergeant First Class. And we'll go ahead and calculate that out. And now, if we look at our tool paths, start with our clearance first. As we see, it's going to go through, it's going to do a real rough job, but it's going to do most of the job and clear things, clean things up for us. Sorry, I have allergies that are starting to make my nose itch a little bit. All right, for the second tool path, we're using a 1 8 inch bit. And it, on this particular V-carve, it's not going to do much. It hits a few spots here and there and cleans it up. And then our final pass, we're going to put just a, a slight bevel on the rank insignia by running our 10.5 degree tapered ball nose as a v-bit it goes through it finishes and we have a nice clean surface now like I said this section over here to the right this section on the right is going to be where we laser inscribe uh, as I mentioned I picked up the X tool uh, s1 uh, 20 watt diode laser uh, if you'd like to see content on that, please make sure to mention that in the comments. And while you're at it, if you're enjoying the video, take a moment to like and subscribe and catch part two and part three of this little series. All right, so after we've made our tool paths, we'll export those to the CNC and we'll proceed on to cutting the job.
So after we ran through the laser engraver and through the CNC, this is what our product is looking like so far, what our plaque is looking like. 
we've got our paragraph and our engraved name and date and of course the rank insignia of a sergeant first class. Uh, please stick around. We will finish this part of the project up in part three of our three-part series. So please take the moment to like, subscribe, and we'll be back with part two in a couple of days. Thanks for watching, and here's some other videos I think you'll like.